Right, I see before Fallout 4 comes out, I just need to give it a quick pre warning in one, yes, it is great to have high intelligence all the way in. Um, because if you read, um, intelligence is a measure of your overall mental acuity, it, it affects a number of experience points earned. Okay, that's your hit or miss how good this is going to be. Um, from speaking from Skyrim terms, um, you could, unless you really want to power level and just like be ultra max quick as you can, that's fine, it, this doesn't matter, but um, in Skyrim, if you level too quick, you'll end up finding nothing a challenge. Um, you, you will like literally like out level where you're meant to be at certain areas and everything will just be a cakewalk. So, and it can take away the, you know, the immersion, the difficulty, uh, other bits and bobs like that. So, I don't know. That's why one. That's why I'm only taking it to six because let's say everything gives you an extra two percent experience. So when you've maxed it, you get an extra twenty percent experience. You know, that's quite a hefty chunk uh, in in retrospect. So six, yeah, I, I don't actually know what the percentage is, but two percent per not seems reasonable, I reckon. Uh, and I think twelve percent because I'm taking it to six because the stuff you get in it um, is great. Uh, but you know, as all I'm saying is, is just if you're not wanted to go crazy uh, and and super power level, um, then be careful about throwing too many on that because you might. Uh, take a little bit of the fun away and the immersion away from the game um, but that's all I'm saying on that um, so let me know, like, comment, subscribe and I'll see you in Fallout tomorrow, bye bye